March 1st, Friday. Of course, I went grocery shopping because we're going to be doing a shamanism, aka Jingle Bell tomorrow. It's morning time somewhere, so I've got to wake up. It's about 5.30. Got to start making rice. Yummy? Yeah? Chicken yummy? cooking up kabong today but I forgot to record from the beginning so I have my pot going here with the chicken that I'm gonna take out to shred in a little bit making my curry um, sauce to add into the pot yeah I am boiling noodles here Thank mm -hmm. you. 
So I happened to go by Daiso yesterday and happened to see these containers. Um, they had a lot of other sizes, but I happened to pick up these two sizes from, to store my kitchen spices or whatnot or dry goods because currently I am using like the glass mason jars with the twist tops. These you can get it from Amazon, um, but they're not very safe because the other day I happened to have one slip out um, of my hand and it totally broke like all over my counter and with little kids in the home too it was just not safe at all and also with the way the cupboards are here um to like things toppling out of the <laughs> the cabinet is possible and so I decided that maybe I need to go the plastic route for now um until I can have like a full-on pantry but I thought these were kind of cute. Um, they open this way. And so see this little top is here. And then you can just grab your dry goods or have a little scooper inside. So we'll go ahead and try these out. And then I'll just save these glass jars for more like refrigeration or um, things that I want to refrigerate inside the refrigerator. Um, and then once I have time, I will create labels for these and we'll see how they go. But currently, this is all I have for my fried onions. So let's go ahead and just pour it into one of these. And I'm just going to try to do the best that I can to get them in. to be washed and I'll have this lid back on and here we go what do you guys think I think it works honestly um